Hey, greetings YouTube, performance reviews where I give you the review from the technician's point of view. And today we're going to talk about floor tools as part of a series in accessories because accessories can be as important as the vacuum cleaner sometimes in terms of cleaning. You know, you hear that saying, you need the right tool for the job. Well, we're going to be talking about the right tool for the job. And today we're going to be talking about parquet tools, particularly the Mila parquet twister and the Visselwork uh, standard fit-all attachment. Now, if you're unfamiliar, these are both made by the same company. Visselwork makes the attachments for Mila. No, the fittings are not interchangeable. Mila uses their own fitting, where other vacuums will use an inch and a quarter. So keep that in mind. You need to buy the specific version for your cleaner. Now, what this does is a couple things. One, it adds a lot of articulation to the nozzle. You can see that it goes basically 180 degrees. Um, it also maintains contact with the floor at any angle. And the reason that's important is with a traditional tool, you have to go at the angle of the tool. And then if you're a little bit taller or a little bit shorter, the tool doesn't make contact properly with the floor. So these double jointed swivel neck tools are genius. The other thing that they've done, unlike a tool where you would just have just bristles, there are cutouts in these bristles along here. This allows big objects to pass in. Very important when cleaning. Now the bottom side is very plain Jane. It's just a whole, an area for the debris to go through. And like I said, these are made, these are the same, basically the same tool. You know, the reason that the Mila is a little different is the Mila typically moves more air than most portable vacuum cleaners. So they use slightly larger fittings. Uh, and you can see the same thing happen with some other manufacturers that do that same sort of thing. So keep in mind, these might not fit your vacuum. They might fit your vacuum. You know, figure out if it's an inch and a quarter or if it's a proprietary button lock or, or whatnot before you just go purchase one of these. Um, and if you're watching on YouTube, I'll have links below to each version with like a little description of which one you want. Hopefully this helps you buy what you need. So again, you see the bottom of this and you can see where that would swivel. And again, these are really soft, uh, really soft brushes. They're not gonna scratch anything. However, the downside of all these great things is this does not do area rugs. This does not do wall to wall carpet. This is only for hard floor. So keep that in mind when you're using this. If you do have both types of floors, you'll be switching back and forth. All right, what we're gonna do now is I'm just gonna go through a couple different types of debris and show you how this works. First up, baking flour. Next up, cat litter. Let's try some fresh pet hair. Breakfast cereal. All right, now let's talk about maintenance and some of the things with this style of tool. 
Now, I did a video a while ago where I compared all the tools, and I've also talked about other tools in the Visalwork family that solve the issue I'm about to talk about. And that is, pet hair will clump up and stick to the hairs. Now, as you vacuum, it moves its way in there. It naturally is gonna move its way in there. But when you're done vacuuming, you do need to suck it off with the attachment. Otherwise, you're just gonna have a hairy attachment. And there are tools that Visalwork makes where you don't have the articulation, but you trade that articulation for not having to do that maintenance. So if you have a, like five dogs or something, this might not be the attachment for you, but one to two pets, it shouldn't be an issue. Again, like most floor tools when you're done vacuuming, just vacuum it off and then hair will come right off, as you can see here. All right, let's talk about why you buy this tool. This tool allows you to go in and articulate in areas very efficiently and clean a large complicated area very easily. You notice you can go side to side with this tool, whether you're left or right handed. This allows you to clean a lot faster. So you can go through a house or a big area, get around, maneuver stuff, it flips around things, and you can clean that whole space Get every inch super fast. I want to demonstrate that from a different angle, so it might look more like this when you're using it. But again, that side-to-side -side motion that you can accomplish with this tool means you have an omnidirectional cleaning path. Truly great for getting big areas and around stuff. Well, my final thoughts on this are that if you have a large area with a lot of fine dust, and delicate wood floors. This is a great attachment for you. It does work good on other types of floors as well, but one of the primary reasons for the soft bristle is not to scratch the floor. Um, so any floors really that scratch easily. This attachment is light, super light, and it fits all heights, whether you're seven foot or four foot nothing, this is going to work with your body type. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Performance Reviews so you don't miss any of my latest videos. Check out one of these other videos also at the end. I've done a lot of different videos on floor tools. I'm sure I have what you're looking for. And have yourself a wonderful day.